G'day people, this is an update on the free boat giveaway. Yes, it's still on, it's likely to go on for well, quite a while yet. Um, so get your entry in, don't think it's over, it's certainly not over. I've had a heap of entries. Uh, most to follow the rules to the two to three minute video mark. Uh, a couple of notable exceptions. One, hello bird. Oh yeah, this is sitting right above the camera. Top stuff, mate. Um, there's not a clap. He's looking at me. Where's my food? Where's my food? Anyway, let's see if we can deal around the chirping. Uh, where was I? Where was I? Oh yeah, uh, 25 minutes and 30 minute, 33 minute videos. Now. Uh, I didn't just bin them because you know there's still entries, but I did skim through and I watched at least three minutes worth. There's also was uh, one without a video. Well, there's two without a video. Um, basically, five words and half a picture of his face. And uh, then we had this really really long email from this uh, guy who was um, going through tremendous trouble with the whole family. He's going, I'm going to have to kill this bird, people. Oh, okay, he didn't kill it for all you animal lo lovers. I, I, I love annoying sparrow, right? I mean, if I had a rock. So he wrote in, um, it was huge. It was this huge email. It just kept on going. I don't know how many pages, but it was at least 10 or 12 minutes of me speed reading. And I was on the bus, so I could afford the time. So I was re uh, reading it, and he, he got me right at the word, uh, right at the get-go. He's got its title, Life and Death. And he goes in about how there's a female member of his family that's in big trouble, like really big trouble, and it's affecting everyone. It apparently is even affecting her dog, who can see all the turmoil and all the craziness. And um, it's yapping all the time, barking all the time. Anyway, so, and um, so he's writing not on behalf of himself, on someone else, which is an admirable thing, albeit his family. Yes, you always want to support your family. But he's going into it, and it's vague, but also goes into specifics of how the family is just getting torn apart because they can't help this one person. He, God knows he's tried. Whatever he tries, fails, doesn't matter. I mean, and this has been going for a long time. And I really felt for the guy. And it just went on and on and on. And apparently, them getting the boat is going to solve the, all their problems. Well, number one, sometimes getting a boat creates more problems than it solves. Uh, having a boat's a great thing, but you have to be committed. So make sure any entrance, you've got to be committed because boats do have problems. Okay? And mine's an old boat too, and there are issues that have to be solved. And ongoing issues but mind you i think i have less problems than the hh 55 which was new that i got on to a few years back but anyway i digress but it's a simpler boat so uh he goes on and on and on and she's it's almost like there's going to be a death now i don't know if she's physically ill or there's got disease or something but it goes on and on and i was thinking and i got in i got in late and uh, I, was, I went to bed and I thought, oh no, I'm going to be thinking about this all night. Another sleepless night. And I was thinking, I was thinking, life and death, I was putting it, you know, mulling it all over. And then I had an epiphany and I was all calm and then I went and had a very good night's sleep. Which to me is not probably more than four and a half hours, but mm, I take it when I can get it. And I've got a lot of worries on people at the moment, you know. But... Um, well, where was I? I was going to say, yeah, we're moving the factory, so it's delaying things a little bit. But that's not a part of this giveaway, so let's just scrub that bit. So, woke up and I got on the computer straight away and sent him an email. I said, is this female member your mother-in-law? And is that her dog that's yap, yap, yapping and driving everyone crazy, as well as the mother-in-law, probably also doing her yap, yap, yapping in her own way? He writes back, he goes, yes, she needs a Viking's funeral. And I said, well, I can't be a party to any death, because she's not dead yet, obviously, but I think a Viking funeral is they send it off and light the boat on fire. I thought of better things. I said, I can't be better uh, a party to this. Um, and he said, well, at least, can I tie her up, chuck her in? You said it's got wind vane steering, it'll steer itself. 
I'll jump on, get it pointing in the right direction, which is diametrically opposite to where he lives, and send her off, and all things will be solved. I think we can do better with the entries than that, people. I think there are more deserving people. So if you do know of anyone that's deserving, send in your applications, and, or, sorry, get them to send in something, and we'll see what's what. Anyway, I hope you're having a good time, and I'll give you more updates in the future.